Hey, this is Nate Mill. In this video, I'll show you how to install the necessary drivers and Droid Razor utility in order to root your Droid Razor or Razor Max. This is part one of my Droid Razor how to series. So, the first step will be to download and install the Droid Razor drivers. The link for that will be in the video description and it will take you to this website. Go ahead and click the free download link. Wait 45 seconds and your download should automatically begin and save to your downloads directory. So when that's finished, you should see an icon that looks like this called the Droid Razor Driver. Just go ahead and double click on that. All right, when it says completed, just go ahead and press close. We're then going to download the Droid Razor utility. So go to that link in the video description, which will take you to this website. Big thanks to Matt L. Groff for this utility. So go ahead and scroll down and click on the link here. Wait 10 seconds and your download should automatically begin and save to your downloads directory. Now this file is about 800 megabytes so it might take a while depending on your internet speed. Alright, notice the download has started here automatically. So when that's finished, you will have a file that looks just like this. It's a 7-zip file, so we'll need the 7-zip application to unzip it. So download the next link in the video description, which will take you here. Go ahead and click the free download link. Wait your 45 seconds and the download should start automatically and be in your downloads directory. So when that's finished, it'll look like this. 7-zip installer. Just go ahead and double click on it. And click install. I already have it installed, so I'm not going to do it again. We'll then need to open the 7-zip file manager so you can click start and in the search bar type 7 dash zip you'd see it right here under programs okay you then need to navigate to wherever you saved the droid razor utility you can click this button here to go up a directory so mine's on the desktop so I'll navigate there find the droid razor utility dot 7 z and click the extract button. Choose where you want to extract it to, it doesn't matter. So I'll leave it on the desktop and I'll press OK. Alright, so it might take a couple minutes to finish extracting. When it's finished, go ahead and close this window and you should see the extracted folder. At this point, you're ready to plug your Droid Razor or Razor Max into your computer and turn on USB debugging. To enable USB debugging, first make sure your phone is plugged into your computer. Then press Menu, Settings, Find Applications, Development, and check the first option, USB debugging. Press yes, and you can press home. We then need to change the phone to charge only, so drag down the notification bar, select USB connection, change it to charge only, and press OK.